Pepper Morning Ladies, my name is Chaz, and welcome to the What If? Him. Him. Deku was Jerry Rig. And, yeah, I know it's Ben 10, and I used one of his aliens, but that's okay. Because, <clears throat> this is what's. This What If came into. or came to me in a dream. I basically was, like, in that dream, I watched, like, a alternate version of My Hero Academia, where Zuko was it born with, or, so, yeah, this. So, this is what Zuko looks like as Jerry Rig, or has Jerry Riggs as powers, and... Yeah. I was going to uh, include his hat, but then I was like, and goggles, but then I was like, no. So now, let's begin. <clears throat> Instead of normal, like, Zuko being born kind of segment thing... Let's say Zuku was born, or, so Zuku and Zumi were born in, in this alter, or so, so in this alternate universe was getting attacked by Waybads. And Waybads were basically because back then, <coughs> In order for them to, so they take out their frustrations on the poor planet. That poor little planet was Earth. But the, yeah. So Zuku was born during the same time. And so at age of four, or Zuku and Zumi were at age of four, they go to the Quark Doctor. And they both... So, both of them have quirks. And, of course... But Zuku's is... Is called, like, Flame Smarts. So, he's basically a... Hothead when he's... As... He can link up to the Waybads and but he can also you know, can shoot fireball and I know that Jerry doesn't have that power, but I'm just using the fused form <coughs> of Jerry Rig with Heat Blast. So, yeah. So, the... Yeah. So, Zuku was, was like... Hmm. So, when he, when he was walking home... He wanted to... Or, actually, one of his friends... Friends... I forgot to add her, but the, yeah. Make sure to add hers to there. So, yeah. Zuku was as friends with her. And she's... So this alternate version of her is not the same thing as in canon. The, in canon, she cares about, like, creating stuff and making stuff for people, whom, that stuff. But in this alternate timeline, she actually, she loves, or it's almost similar, but the major difference is that she actually has a humongous crush on Zuku. 
she wants him to be her boyfriend so that the for just yeah you know. so Zuku's who is like personality thing because he is like has the same powers as Jerry Rig and also the same smarts as him. So yeah, Zuku ends up went to a scrapyard instead. And what does he do? He makes a cannon that can float in midair. Um, and so he hides it from um, anyone who wants to discover it. Plus, the machine actually works on against or the way bads. So when Zuku was walking home from, because how fast he was, he walked home shortly after. As he says, sir, I'm late. I just had to, like, hang, go and do something real quick. So then, yeah. So then Zuku's was like smarter than his sister but because the his parents always prefer her over or no his sister over him cuz it wasn't It was actually because of his quirk. But little did they know that Zuku's actual quirk. Because his actual quirk that he has. He has two quirks, first of all. Instead of one. The one that. Makes him super smart, super fast, and he could shoot fireball thing. Well, and he can also melt stuff. But the... He mostly relies on that because the... It wasn't... And his number two is also fire-based one. It's fire manipulation. So... So both covers like his offense and defense. <sighs> yeah. So then when Zuku ends up he may actually a time skip to fifteen. And Zuku made the first was twin barrel cannons that can Injure or kill way bads, but he needed a transport vehicle that can. So he made a tire ship out of like scrap metal and he forged it to create newer metals and yeah. And when he was done, he was like, huh. So he also made a giant robot similar size to Waybads. And by the way, I forgot to mention, Waybads in this what if are bigger than Mountain Ladies' as transformation forms. Basically, the they could only... So, Mountain Ladies' transformation could only go to, like, a top of Mountain Ladies' Waybads' toenails. 
So, yeah. So Zuku, who was like, let's bring him, let's bring them down, shall we? <laughs> As Zuku was gr like Greeble. So, so they go to UA and they're in class or so. So, Mina or Maya. Hold on, just one second. Sorry about that. If you guys are hearing the dogs barking in the background, let me know. Okay, so, yeah. There it is. So, so yeah, Zuku ends up. So, runs into. Maya again. As so Zuku is more of a so he's in class one B. Him. As he says, I'll do in good in any field. So then yeah. Zuku ends up how long? The yeah. So, Zuku ends up hanging out with Maya during after school. So, and then the... Then the creatures go to UA during the... Because of the normal, like, all-for-ones, or... Actually, all no way bad is rampage. They had to go do like his, but the Azuku looks at them and says, or so, yeah, because they can't go to USJ because the <clears throat> they're still dealing with. The overall, or no, the way bads. But Zuku knew, had a big idea. As he s says to himself, I got a big plan. As he te did tell Baku, go, he had plans. Or actually, he told the Blood Hero that he has plans to do something about these. So then, he did amount the cannons to the... Or he did fly the cannons to the his own special spaceship thing. Or ship. As... And Zuku's like, huh, yeah, I agree. So then he ends up, he says, huh, I have a plan to get rid of all the way bads. I'll be right back. As he says, where are you going? As Zuku runs off, as he builds that machine, <coughs> He, that is like, or actually, he, when he was only seven years old, he built a machine that can do a, like basically, <clears throat> just from him call that machine. And using the code five one nine three. Yeah. So the yeah. Or Zuku likes to call the machine the destroyer her of the way bads. 
So, Zuku. <coughs> No one noticed. Noticed? But then Zuku ends up doing something that's really funny. Funny. Because there's so many, like, <clears throat> way bads that not even one single pro hero could take out, or multiple oh, pro heroes try to take out. Or tries to take out one. But Zuku says, is there a phone? Uh, yeah, why? Well, may I see it? Sure. As Zuku calls the exact number and types in the exact pin number that I just said. And <clears throat> as Zuku's like, or as the machine go gets activated. As Zuku's like, ha ha. Brace for impact. What do you mean? What did you do? Did you release a nuclear bomb or something? No, no, no. As he shows a picture on screen. As he shows it. This is called Doom of the you know, Waybads. It's a fancy name. Hmm. This, this can basically is like a stronger version and heavily modified thing. Then only <coughs> it can be used for waybads and the overpowered quirks, like nullifying their powers. Others, but unless you're a waybag or waybad, and should I say, it will kill you after. If you're if you were, you're crazy. Yeah, thank you. So then the machine activates and it explodes, or not explodes, but it releases this boom right around the entire globe as the Waybads looked over and they got obliterated like boom. One by one, two by two, three by threes, Four by fours and all of the above. Zuku saved everyone. As he says, yeah, I know. So they can't believe Zuku was the one that saved everybody. Shall we? Yeah. Because it didn't affect the quirks. Or it didn't affect the humans. But they were like, man. But how did you do that? As only Class 1B knew about the what just truly happened. Class A was like, what just happened? I, I don't remember it or I don't it I don't feel different or yeah but then Zuku's classmates or even blood heroes like I'm impressed that you even knew how to deal with them yeah So then the, yeah. It sure did clean out the entire clocks. It's only used for emergencies. Yeah, so then... <clears throat> And 
where did all the waybads go? Well, <clears throat> they've been teleported to a, an alternate universe. Or should I say, to the void light dimension. So then the, yeah. So then he got, so after he was like, done him. he was about to sneeze and but he can't because or actually he can sneeze but if he does then a fireball comes out because yeah so when he sneezed so loud as a fireball just boom yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> As the uh, flames went right back into his nostrils. Like that one scene where in the fairy tales. Almost I forget. And yeah. Where the main character I believe. The one that can absorb fire. Yeah. Can... Yeah, so then when when he got back, or when he got out of school, like, say, after school, Maya was there, and she hugs her boyfriend. But she didn't know that Zuku was as the one that killed all the... Um, way bad, so that the, yeah. him. <clears throat> but, there is one survived. The one, on that day, was a female, oh, way bad. Yeah, her. She ends up, um, she still can't believe that some <clears throat> something happened to her species. And so that's pushed her more rageful. <clears throat> but turns out it was an alternate version of or so the species reason why the species chose Earth to take their frustrations out on was actually here's a plot twist. It was Zuku's who number two. Basically all of the waybads is and are actually his children's. Yeah. So, the reincarnation of Zuku <coughs> was... So no one knew about that part. And reason why that Waybads were angry in the first place and takes their anger out on, like, certain people or, like, the entire planet was because deep down they were sad that they s saw their own father get, like, basically he ends up becoming dead. Like he got killed or silent one. But then the reincarnation came and chose Zuku. Or so basically reincarnated as it inside of a new body. That's why Zuku has two quirks. 
and four powers. Infinity, zero, and metaverse, and the way big, or way bad. So basically, <coughs> yeah. So, but no one knew that Zuku was the reincarnation of the, their, yeah. So then when, so Maya and Zuku were dating. And then it was time. Because this is an alternate universe, so I'm not going to base this on, like, canon version. So, <clears throat> and, and plus I already know that My Hero Academia ended, but the, yeah. So, Mina, or no, Maya, M-E-I, ends up um, in a wedding dress, and getting married to Zuko. So she does get married to Zuko. And so she ends up basically she ends up getting or she, she gave birth to ten kids. Yeah, but turns out the ten kids were actually way bads. All ten of them were now <coughs> way bads, and also, so now when she gave birth to all ten of them, Zuku is, is happy about it. But also, at the same time, Zuku is confused about the... Because they have similar color scheme to Waybadge's color scheme without the spikes all over them. But then, out of nowhere, dawns on him. As it, he just realized is that because the original, like himself, <clears throat> Before, because he realized that he was the reincarnation of the Waybads' fathers before. As he's just, like, surprised that... He, as he can't believe it. So then... So... Maya goes, or has a, they have a house, basically a giant mansion that is bigger than the entire planet. So they actually had island, their own personal island. <coughs> so then Zuku... Whom walks around to get his head on straight. Just there's as he tells her that there's nothing against you. It's just the I just thought about something. And she's like, "Let's talk about it." You know those kids that we have the. One with gray skin, purple, home, like clothing, or like basically with horns. Yeah. 
I remember that. But how would you feel about... Or, you know, what species they are? Well, I really don't know. As she looks at him, says that. And as... They are way bads. Oh, the same ones that were disappeared without a trace? Yeah. And I think I know why that the... They took their angers on Earth instead of any other planet. And she's surprised about hearing this. What made them choose Earth instead of that? It's their father's deaths. The original Zuku. I'm just a reincarnation of him. I just realized that when... After seeing the kids... Maybe you're just overreacting. It's just the... <clears throat> if that's true, then... The... They don't know that you're still alive. So then, a time skip to All Might vs. All for One. So, All for One was controlling a female way bad. And she was about to end All Might's life. But then... A booming voice comes out of nowhere. Her. As basically a giant robot, same size, and hits the. or takes the arm. like. like that was. like he stops the. her attack. And as he says, enough, as he tosses her, and all for one jumps down. As he says that, the, <clears throat> as he looks down at the all for one, as he grabs all for one, because he knows as as a female whom way bad was was about to who's hit into him but then as but then when Zuka looked at all for one and tells him <clears throat> don't mess with my Favorite daughter, her, you creep, and she, as she stops herself, home, and she can't believe. She doesn't know even know who this robot is talking about, as all for one commands her to like, whom. Like to kill the robot, but then she's confused as she as he looks at her and tells her that name does Zuku ring the bell as her eyes widen and here, Ben, ten. Sure, there's nothing. Okay, Ben, ten. Way, Ben, 
and or email Wayman's is her face when she actually made the same thing thing as she can't believe as an aura came from Zuku from the robot not as but then <coughs> Zuku's as he did tell her that she is his still his favorite no matter what as then he basically reveals who he is <clears throat> as she can't believe that her own father was there as she runs up to him but instead of like hitting him in the chest she just hugged him um as she can't believe that as she growls like a soft growl as her tears coming down as a robot that was still had all for one and as he hugs her as he says to her that you have been forgiven and Hmm. They, as she, as he tells her that I know that the reincarnation and, and no, because they he forgot that Zuku's or their father can be reincarnated into some body. As he, as she can't believe it, as she hugs him, him, as he pets her on the head, as she collapsed on, like, with her knees bent, as she basically, she knew that. And she shouldn't. So, yeah. So then, all for one, pulls out a gun. And as he's about to shoot her in the head, or should I say, the. with a. like, special designed bullet. That is going to destroy her if... As Zuku comes out of nowhere... Her... As... <coughs> he said... Her... Zuku looks up... As he blocks the... As he basically tells her... Let me deal with all for one... As he, as Zuku's came out of the robot vehicle, as she, he, as he jumps down, as he was about to, uh, as before All for One pulls the trigger, Zuku, whom grabs and basically. Tosses the gun and, like, he says, You will not hurt my daughter. As Zuku gets slapped by all for one. If I can't hint ham her, I'll take your life. As the As 
and the female way bad and turn is about knows of that Zuku or actually she knows that she saw like her him die once and she doesn't want him to die again. So what does she do? She grabs overhaul and breaks him around or like tosses him around and like basically you know how Ben ten thousand and like punched Kevin eleven thousand to the ground. Huh? Well, Zuku ends up, or so, the female Waybad punched all for one to the ground. Like, literally, as all for one was as Zuku's, was like, huh. And all for one starts laughing, like, huh. You think this is inevitable? Hmm. No, but this is. As. As a ship comes out of nowhere, a battleship, um, with a twin barrel cannons, and pointing right at all for ones. As he says, you want to do the honors? As the ship turns into a gun for, it was like a twin barrel shotgun, but it's, as she grabs it and pulls it down, the handle was perfect size. As she points it right at all for one. And as she pulls the trigger. And bang! All for one was dead in about two seconds. Or 30 seconds. Boom! Dead. As, yeah. So then, the, as, he, he takes her home. Come on now, sweet pea. He, as Zuko says to Waybeg or Waybad, as she's like, okay, he, huh? as she's like going with him to the island, because as everybody's like wondering why he, he, Name. So he basically, and before we end this video, <clears throat> he did bring all the waybads that was, or everybody thought they were killed off, but no, they got transported into a pocket universe. So they came back, and Zuku. Was now the father of his, of his present day and his past life. He was his children's. So basically, <clears throat> he has, like, I mean a lot of kids. Like, ten kids for... From his present day, and he had one hundred, or no, actually two hundred kids in his past, or before he got reincarnated to Earth. So Zuku explains everything, like he was the <clears throat> he was the creator of the Waybad species. And the, yeah. So then, when 
Inko Asashi Zumi heard that Zuku was the father of the Waybads, they had so much respect for him now. They used to, like, not invite him to, like, birthday parties or, like, graduation for the... But then when they said, it's like the... You're not coming to the <coughs> birthday party or, like, anything because you're... You're weak, or then, oh yeah, I have a th- my own hinge, as they see. Like, yeah, it's like that meme that everybody says that about not gambling one, but the one that says, "Ling." How can you kill us? Oh, I can't kill you. But my buddies can. Say hi, buddy. Oh, and then the background noise comes in. Yeah. Well, Zuku ends up basically being, you know, Zuku. Is that kind of person. So, because of the how much... They respected Zumi. He always is didn't get any gifts from them, so that was before. But then the day came of them having the birthday party, and they were so he didn't invite his parents. Or his sister, because the... He... Because they always... As he always tells the Maya that they always... He... Choose to do... Celebrate my little sister's birthday, but not me. He... So, yeah... As she can't believe that. Yeah. So when Zuku ends up. Basically. Told his wife that. Dame. Yeah. So they ended up. Basically agreeing that they. Will not never allow. Zuku. To basically, or they will never allow his family to participate in any events because they always choose his sister over him. So, yeah, Zuku ends up having a birthday party with his, his kids and his wife. As no one, oh, so because as um, because Inko and Sashi had no contact with Zuku because they took him off of their phones, but that was before. But then the yeah. <clears throat> as Zumi is like, or actually, Zumi did her birthday thing, like her own birthday party with her family. But then, but she's like missing one important person. Because after she, her, Heard that Zuku had way bads. They plus he was better than her in every way. So then, 
So he, or so she calls him. As Zumi actually, or so Zuku answers. As the, yeah, her, so she says, hey, brother, what's up? Huh, how's your birthday? As Zuku says to, how's your birthday doing? Well, the, after, I know that you're probably busy with your birthday because the, him, and I also know that as Inko actually suggested that the, the Zuku should and like go and participate with the these uh, special events because. So what does, so Zumi actually, so Inko and Sashi name was there with Zumi as she, as one of them says, sorry about the, I know that you're more useful and we didn't know that you were actually, I know that you're been born, or I know that you were, you are born, I know that you're busy with stuff and all that stuff, but let's make things up to you, and as Zuku says, yeah, but it's the This is how well, I feel with those day years over those years that you never thought that about her son or not not even her son. He, she so Zuku tells Inko and Sashi and Zumi that name that both Inko and Sashi always chose you, Zumi, over me all the time. And so, so that's why I chose to celebrate my own birthday with my own family that I care about. Okay. So, yeah. So, Inko and Asashi, after Zuku hung up, Inko starts to cry as she can't believe that as Asashi's like, Still remember those years that were as so then Inko and Asashi and Zumi went over and they did <coughs> call Maya because the yeah Zuku was it, it wants to be as like a secret birthday thing because when she when they heard that Zuku's was about to cut them out of their his life because of as Inko and Sashi tells me Maya that the I know that in or Zuku is is probably busy, but I know that 
as Maya understands what they're trying to say, they're apologizing to him and make it up to him. Yeah. So, yeah. So, what does Zuko do? Or so, they ended up having this secret birthday party. So, they basically... Zuko, like, got surprised as... You know, as Inko hugs Zuko. As... <coughs> It was too overwhelming. Thing. <coughs> and the... Yeah. So Zuku ends up... Is happy that the... Zuku... Actually had a gift planned. For... Z Zumi. Actually. Because he didn't tell them... But they, he actually, because Zumi was 18. She just got her driver's license. And her parents, parents didn't even buy a car for her. But then, but her brother ends up doing something that he actually made a car for her and her family. As he also got gifts for everyone else. As he actually, he walks up to his sister and says, huh, I actually got a gift for you too. Come with me. Or... First, cover your eyes. And so they basically... He walks her to the... The back of a house. Or no, front of the house. Or in the garage. And... Okay, Zumi. Open your eyes. As... She opens them, and she sees a car, a brand new cyber truck that he just invented. It wasn't a prototype, actually. He already made that first prototype, but he actually made it way safer and way more, like, ding, safety. Way more safe for her without him. As Zumi accidentally, like when she turned around, she accidentally hits him in, in the nose. Or actually, right in the... Or actually backhand him to the face as she says, "Oops, sorry, I get excited." Remember, yeah, I forgot that you sometimes get too excited and start whacking me. Hey, with just as as she hugs her own brother, <clears throat> and then as yeah, because. Zuku actually says, I kind of felt bad because the, because I um, had a, this sh giant ship and you have, now have a, I, so I gave you the cyber truck. <laughs> and... He did make a shrink ray, so to shrink, like, way bad, or his kids down to the human level, to actually fit into, like, grocery stores or, yeah. 
so, <clears throat> yeah. So then the, yeah, it was way safer now because he actually calls it a, or instead of calling it Cybertruck, it was called the, the Jerry Rig. So yeah, Zuku ends up basically. He is quite tough. And by the way, I forgot to mention in the beginning video, the one that was before this video, the what if Deku was, or what if Deku's his nightmare was in my hair academia, was short, so that's why this is the number two what if that I did today, so, <clears throat> so then Zuku ends up, so without further ado, let's continue, so yeah, so then when Inko and Shashi came out with them, and they saw the cyber, or no, jerry rig, it was a more modern version of a hot rod that can handle it was like a limousine kind and Zumi he and Inko and Sashi were like in like, their jaws dropped when they saw what Zuko had. Or made for, yeah. <clears throat> so, yeah. So this is the end of the what if. Please leave a like, share, subscribe, comment, and do all that fun stuff. And sorry if these videos get too long or too short. Because... Sometimes I really talk so fast, but some of them, um, like the what if Deku was, as or what if Deku's his nightmare was in my hairdemia, was similar to, the, what if Ochako's his nightmare was in my hairdemia, and fun fact, or, weird fact, that. Basically. The, it was a, like, clean version, but there was a cursed version of it where the clown girl actually took Ochako's, or took over Ochako's body, a.k.a. Like, basically turning her into a, like, a balloon, hmm, or a rag doll, um, balloon, and, yeah, she did some messed up things to Ochako's body. And I will not say name. And yeah. It was like <laughs> if I know that some girls play with Barbie dolls things. It's like that. Like she puts Clothes on, or like basically changing her outfits and doing weirdest stuff to, like how girls, girls play with their Barbie toys things. <laughs> yeah, so. 
it's a cursed version, so you don't really don't. I don't need to say anything else. So and in my next what if that I'm thinking about doing is a what if um that who was. The, I really don't know, but I'll figure something out. So, have a good night or day, to bend on the time zones, and cha-ching! I'm not slacking uh, off. So, peace.